sports. It's in the game. Up next, it is our main event of the evening between El Toro and Mr. Untouchable. Our tale of the tape for this heavyweight fight. Mr. Untouchable is 18. El Toro is 30. Mr. Untouchable will have a five inch reach advantage. With the official introductions, here is Bruce Buffer. Ladies and gentlemen, this is the main event of the evening. And when the action begins, a referee in charge. This is the moment UFC fans around the world have been waiting for. Live from the Honda Center in Anaheim, California. It's time! El Toro. Are you ready? Mr. Untouchable. Here we go! Tonight's main event of the evening is scheduled for five five-minute rounds. Black trunks for Mr. Untouchable. White trunks for El Toro. Wow! That's a man oh, hard uppercut. Big shot! Oh, very nice. He was looking for the head kick, but it was blocked. Joe, it looks like he's bleeding over the left eye. It'll be interesting to see if it affects his vision. Very good defense on display here. Very good blocks. Nice kicks. He's starting to land those kicks in the body. All oh, right on that one. Another nice kick. Very solid. That's Huge a beautiful shot with the hook. Good combinations. Oh, big body kick. Oh, did he snap that kick? He is going after it here. Left nice hand. combination. Hard straight punch. That's Huge a solid hook. hook. Man, he 
just missed. What a jab. Joe, that was well done, blocking the punch. Yeah, he's digging into that leg kick. Joe, he's landing at will. And again, he's able to connect with the leg kick. He's done a really good job here so far, Joe. And he's going to take the spring out of his opponent's step. Couldn't agree with you more, Mike. Oh! It is all over! Huge right-hand shot that got him the victory. Joe, here's the finish on our fight replay. Let's take a look at the replay here. Look at this huge straight punch that causes the knockout. Let's take a look at it one more time here. Perfect timing on this punch, and it lands right on the button. Check it out here. Bam! Lights out. Bruce Buffer has the official decision. Ladies and gentlemen, referee Eve Levine has called a stop to this contest at 3 minutes, 47 seconds of the very first round. Declaring the winner by knockout, El Toro. El Toro wins by knockout. It's a light heavyweight showcase between John Jones and El Toro. Our tale of the tape. For this light heavyweight fight, El Toro is two years his elder. Jones is four inches taller. He will have a 10-inch reach advantage. And with the official introduction. John Jones. Ready to fight. El Toro. Ready. Here we go! Five. Five minute rounds. White trunks for El Toro. Black trunks for Jones. El Toro's opponent is so much taller than him. Joe, what does he have to do to try to counter that? He's got to figure out how to get inside. He's got to get inside the long range of his opponent, get inside the strikes, and work the body. He's doing a great job of mixing things up here, keeping it unpredictable. Oh, that's good a good shot, shot right there. Very good shot. Body kick, look at that. How good is this? Oh, that caught him. Oh, head kick. He lands a head kick. Hooked it damage. Oh, you know, that's a huge that hook. Oh, big body kick. Beautiful hook. Huge kick to the body. There's a nice combination. Hard straight punch. What a huge right hand. 
face also uppercut. Big shot! Hard straight punch. Wow! Oh. He hurt him. Looking to finish the fight. Big shot. Just missed. Solid shot to the body. Oh, big kick. Powerful kick. Oh, that one hurt him. Big punches. Oh, stunning jab. Vicious combination. Big kick just missed. Hard diving punch. Twenty seconds remain in the round. Full guard now. Final seconds of the round. El Toro's a mess. That oh. shot is getting oh. worse. Let's take another look at some of the action from that round. And there's a nice head kick that lands. And here's another head kick. And here's one more perfectly placed head kick. Very impressive striking going on in that round. There's the beautiful Brittany as we get set for round two. Round two. He's definitely going to want to start this round off fast to try to pick up where he left off. His opponent was in big trouble at the end of that round. Joe, that's textbook hand position. What an amazing job. He connects with the straight. Oh, there beautiful you go. combination. Good job blocking the punch. Oh, wow. Nice combination. Big power jam. He's hurt. He's hurt. Oh, Joe, another strong jab. Oh! Solid jab. Oh! Big right hand! Oh! Unbelievable! Big straight punch. Just missed. Oh, and another one. That hurt him. Oh, oh combination. Yeah. Straight punch. Oh, he tagged him. He's in big oh. trouble. Oh. He tagged him. And again. Oh, complete combination. Tremendous hook on the button for the win. Once again, here's our fight replay. And let's take a look at the replay. This is the shot that drops him. Perfect technique. He's clearly in big, big trouble. Let's take a look at it from another angle here. This is the one that causes the knockdown and the subsequent follow-up strikes for the knockout. Great angle here. Boom! And that is all she wrote. With the official decision, here is Bruce Buffer. Ladies and gentlemen, referee Herb Dean is going to stop this contest at 2 minutes, 21 seconds of round number 2. Playing the winner by knockout, El Toro. El Toro, victorious with the knockout.
It's a featherweight matchup between Anthony, Showtime Pettis, and El Toro. Our tale of the tape for this featherweight fight. This is a very even matchup. Everything between these two fighters is virtually identical. And with the official introductions, here's the veteran voice of the Octagon, Bruce Buffer. Ladies and gentlemen, this is... This man is a Muay Thai fighter, making his professional debut here tonight. He stands 5 feet 11 inches tall, weighing in at 145 pounds, fighting out of London, England, El Toro. And now we're producing his opponent, fighting out of the red corner. This man is a Taekwondo fighter, holding a professional record of. Anthony Pettis, El Toro, here we go! Fight scheduled for five five-minute rounds. White trunks for El Toro, black trunks for Pettis. Keep an eye out for the counter strikes of Anthony Pettis. It's one of his best weapons. El Toro with a nice strike. These guys are going at it. Oh, I can't. Wow. He hurt him. How good is that? Combinations here. Look at this. Oh, big body kick. Hard spinning back fist. Oh, another body kick. Big power jab. He is really finding a home for those body kicks. Joe, you're absolutely right. The kicks to the body, significant. Oh, he's really mixing things up tonight. Good punch by Pettis. Big what right a hand. huge right hand! Solid jab. Oh, that's a heavy body kick. Oh, oh, big right hand clipped him. Hard straight punch. Boom, big uppercut. Right to the liver of his opponent. He's hurt to the body. You can tell that shot hurt him bad. Big straight punch. Oh, very nice. Oh, he's going for it here. Again with a solid kick to the body. Back and forth battle. Powerful left hand. Solid shot to the body. Big power in those kicks. And again to the midsection. El Toro with a solid straight. Mad Joe, that was a hard leg kick. There's another. Final minute of round one. Five 
Hawkins. Spinning elbow. Nice. El Toro gets caught by the elbow. Nice strike. Great jab by Pettis. Huge uppercut misses. Man, he's showcasing some great kicks. Good work blocking that. Nice spinning back kick. He landed that, Mike. Round one complete. Joe, both fighters seem determined to keep this fight standing. And the crowd here seems to appreciate a good striking match, Mike. Here's a vicious kick that results in a knockdown. Here we see some beautiful striking and perfect timing on this punch. Here's a powerful head kick that lands. Very exciting round. And the look. There you go, second round. You ready? You ready? <laughs> nice left hook to the body. He really turned that over well. Good block. That right hook connects. Man, you can do it. Kick to the body. He's hurt. He's clearly in pain. He's trying to hang on there, but he is in big trouble. There's a nice combination. Hard straight punch. Man, he just missed. Wow. El Toro with some solid kicks. Another big body kick. He clipped him. El Toro's got to be very pleased with his performance here tonight, Jim. He certainly has done a really good job of landing big shots in this fight, and that's what so far is getting him ahead on the scorecards. Trying to set up a twister. And Anthony's out. He postures into place. And back up. To the body. Great exchanges. Joey did a nice job blocking that punch. There he goes with a one-two. Oh, and he goes on top of the kick. a big shot to the body. They're back up. Nice block of that head shot. That's Hit a solid that look. look. Oh, big right hand. Back to his feet again. Amazing. That's a damaging knee to the body. He hurt him with that hook. Wow, swing and a miss. Joe, that was well done, blocking the punch. That's a good straight. Taking some oh! shots now. Wow! Trying to stay out of trouble here. Big straight punch. Wow! Going wow! to head to round three. Anthony Pettis is lucky to still be in this fight. He was saved by the bell. He certainly was. That was a big shot that landed right before the end of the fight, and he was in big trouble. Here's a big punch that results in a knockdown. And here a perfectly placed punch results in a knockdown. And here we see it from another angle. The lovely Ariane here tonight inside the... Here we go, round three. 
He's definitely going to want to start this round off fast but try to pick up where he left off. His opponent was in big trouble at the end of that round. Trying to grab the leg, and he does. Pettis with the single leg. He's trying to get into position to attack with the Kimura. And he's free from the Kimura. It appears that cut is getting worse. Back up. As we track the fight, we see the number of total strikes landed. Good job blocking the punch. Oh, solid jab. Oh, he lands the roundhouse to the bottom. Nasty leg kick. Nice jab, very snappy jab. Head us with the combination. Wow! He's in deep trouble here, Mike. Continuing to pour it on. Wow! Oh, oh my! Just like that! Beautiful knockout strike here for the victory. Time now for our fight replay. And as we can see here in the replay, it was the hook that ended this fight. Let's see that from another angle. Look at this. And he's out. Bruce Buffer has we'll stopped in this contest at one minute, 45 seconds of round number three. Declaring the winner by knockout, Anthony Showtime Pettis. Anthony Pettis, victorious with the knockout. Up next, it's a women's bantamweight matchup between the chosen one and Finn. Our tale of the tape for this women's bantamweight fight. The chosen one is 18, Big is 30. The rest is virtually identical. Once again, here's the veteran voice of the octagon, Bruce Buffer. Ladies and gentlemen, this is the main event of the evening. The chosen one. You ready? Big. You ready? Here we go! Five. Five minute rounds. White trunks for Big. Black trunks for the chosen one. Big with a solid one, too. She's really mixing things up nicely. Oh, spinning back fit. Solid straight leg. And again, a kick to the body by Big. Nice. Now they're turning it up. Wow! Wow! Back up. Hard straight punch. Big combination.
massive inside leg kick. Big shot! Turning into an all-out slugfest. Oh, very nice. Big straight punch. Good combinations. Great head kick. Big left hand. Vicious combination. Oh! Big oh. shot. That's a good kick to the body by Big. Great job blocking that punch. Big what a punch huge the right hand. Man. Wow. Oh, that's a big head kick. Hard straight punch. Big wow. power in that hook. Nice combination. There's a left that connects. Back up again. Great exchange. The chosen one with the combination. Big hook. Joe, she's doing a great. She got tagged again. She's hurt. Oh, oh my goodness. First round in the books. Great performance by both fighters in that round, Joe. This is turning into a very intriguing matchup. Here's a vicious kick that results in a knockdown. And here, another big shot lands, and another knockdown. And let's look at that from another camera angle. The beautiful Ariani. You ready? You ready? Oh. Round two. That last round was an all-out brawl. If they continue like that in this round, someone's getting knocked out. That huge head kick was blocked. Nice roundhouse kick to the body. Oh! Oh! Oh, that's a big left. Hard straight punch. Back and oh, nice kick to the liver. Combinations here. Oh, big left. <laughs> that bruising on her torso is getting a lot worse. Good kick to the body. The huge head kick is blocked. Nice, very nice combination. Looking for the high kick. Joe, those body strikes are really starting to do some damage. Good combinations landing here. Nice roundhouse kick to the body. Great defense as she continues to block strikes. Spins and a connection on the spinning back kick. And she scores a single leg takedown. She's attempting a submission here. Just over two remain. Yeah, it's pretty deep, Mike. Back that is very tight. <laughs> and it is all over. I love it. Beautiful technique setting it up and a beautiful job in getting that submission. Joe, here's the finish on our fight replay. Again, let's take another look at this twister. 
locks up the one leg, secures the arm over the back of the head, and, and here we see it again. Beautiful submission victory. With the official decision, here is Bruce Buffer. Ladies and gentlemen, referee Eve LeBing has called a stop to this contest at three minutes, three seconds of round number two. Declaring the winner by tap out due to a twister. Bing gets the submission victory here tonight.